Imagine this while you're in this. We know lightning can be deadly when you're on the ground, but what about an airplane? To find out, we went to the experts. This is the Boeing Company Lightning Lab. It's a high voltage test chamber and a high current test chamber to do lightning effects on aircraft and aircraft parts. Lightning's scary enough, <laughs> but for people flying an airplane, you see lightning out the window. Right. Should people be scared when they see that? Not when you're in an airplane, because the plane is designed to handle any kind of attachments to its exterior surface. The exterior surface is a, like a Faraday cage. All the charge will stay on the outside. It becomes a part of the channel, and the current flows right through it. To demonstrate this, they will strike this airplane model with a bolt of lightning from their own Marks generator. When we use this high voltage generator, we mimic what the lightning attachment is going to look like on an aircraft in flight. Whether it's on the nose, the wingtips, the tail, that's what we're gonna look for. So he's ready, lights are ready, and we're charging. It's go time? Okay. Go time. Just saw the test and the plane looks fine. Looks like the same as when we came in. That's right, because this is an initial attachment test. It's a high voltage test. We do a high current test to assess the damage that's in the other room. This is a representation of a piece of aircraft skin. This is our output probe, similar to what we had in the other room, only here, instead of using two megavolts, we use about 50 to 60 kilovolts, but we get 200,000 amps out of it. Forty turn 50. And here's the result. So what that arc did is it penetrated through the paint to the uh, metal layer and discharged about 200,000 amps into that panel. Did it, it didn't go through though, right? No, on a panel of this equivalent thickness on the airplane, it would not go through. It wouldn't go through. And as far as nature goes, how would you compare that strike to what you'd find in nature? That is the highest strike that you would normally see in any aircraft lifetime. From a lightning attachment such as this, you would expect to be able to turn around and fly right back. Well, it's just another thing that you don't worry about. It. Don't worry about if the plane gets hit by lightning, That's right. right. I'm meteorologist Chris Warren, The Weather Channel.